Anyways, so this week's topic is about our fears. In response to Haley's video, um, I remember a couple of weeks ago, she was texting me and was whining because there was a spider in her room and she was flipping out because she couldn't leave because she had to watch the spider so when her mom got home she could kill it fun fact <laughs> um my fears um i hate things without legs that move or things with a lot of legs that move like worms or snakes they really really bother me like i hate looking at them they make me want to throw up a little bit and um like millipedes, they have a thousand legs, they're disgusting, no, no I don't like that, um, I got a haircut, it looks bad, that's not what I'm afraid of, I'm afraid of bad haircuts guys, no, um, I hope my TV's not too loud, um, what else am I afraid of, I'm a pansy, I don't like the dark, I'm, <laughs> always have my TV on. I always sleep with my TV on because I don't like the dark. And I keep looking at my TV over there. I'm sorry. Um, I'm also... Okay, this one's kind of lame. I know. But, like, I've always been really afraid of losing my friends because I worry a lot. I think I have some kind of mental disorder that makes me worry too much. It's bad, and I hate it. But I've always been really afraid that I'm going to lose my friends. And it's always something that I've listed as one of my top fears. I don't like thunderstorms very much. My grandfather's house was, like, demolished by a tornado. So I'm not a fan of storms. Because I don't want my house to get demolished by a tornado. I mean, I don't like spiders, but I wouldn't say I'm, like, completely afraid of them. I'm not gonna, like, run and wait for someone else to kill it like Haley does. I'm gonna step on it. I don't know. I don't like them. I run from bees. I don't know who doesn't run from bees, though. When I was younger, I used to be afraid of sleeping in a bed that was bigger than a twin size because there was this, like, Ernest movie where there was this troll or whatever with, like, three noses and the little girl, like, bent over to look under her bed in her, like, full-size bed and then he wasn't under there. But when she sat back up, the troll was, like, chilling beside her and was all... And then he turned her into a statue or something. I don't remember... But I was always afraid to get a bigger bed like that for a long time. But now I have a queen size bed. And I move a lot in my sleep. So I don't know how I dealt with the twin size bed. Um, bye.